Welcome to Chapter 8 of our Over the Years series, Searching the Legacy. We'll talk about the search functions that are available to our viewers, starting at the top of our home page and continuing below the player there. We'll talk about the menu choices for our legacy playlists, including those for earlier years. We'll talk about searching for them on YouTube and on Google. Indeed, there are many ways you can find the videos you're looking for. First let's look at the search functions at the top of the home page on our website, thinktechhawaii.com, at the top right of that page, there is a magnifying glass icon next to a search text field. If you fill in that field and hit return, it will take you to our advanced search functions further down on the page, where you can do some very sophisticated searching. There are four fields in the advanced search function. The first will search the title and description of the video. The second will search the show series. The third will search for the host. The last is a field that will search the production date or a range of dates for the show. You can use a combination of these fields to do your search. The results will appear in rows of clickable thumbnails on that page. You may notice that there is a list of our latest productions on the right side of the pages on the site. This is very handy if you are looking for a recent production. Each of the shows on this list has a clickable link that will take you to YouTube, where you can play the video for that show. Take a look at the menu on the site, and you will see that it includes links to the recent legacy playlists on our YouTube channel, as well as those for earlier years. When you're on our YouTube channel, you can search for a video using the YouTube search field. Or you can just look through the videos on that playlist and play the ones you like. If you prefer, you can play or shuffle through the videos on that or any playlist. You can also search for our videos on Google itself. A great number of them are included there, and you can find them using Google's powerful search tools. Please likewise keep in mind that all the data we have accumulated on the videos in our archives has been entered in our Apple FileMaker database. As a part of our legacy project, we ultimately hope to make the data and search functions in FileMaker available to our viewers for added search capability. And that's not all. Zoom creates a transcript and an AI summary for every show. We plan to make use of that technology going forward. There have been many notable improvements in Zoom over the past few months, and we expect more, including technology that will give us better color and resolution in the video, and better EQ and normalization of sound in the audio. We'll watch for that and adopt it when it's available. These things will not only provide a better viewer experience for you. They will also make editing easier and faster for our editors. As you can see, there are many ways to find great content in our legacy archives and to do useful research with it. You are free of course, to use what you find as Creative Commons content. It's up to you to figure out what you'd like to learn, and to find it using the powerful search tools on our site and our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. Good hunting, and we'll see you next time, right here on ThinkTech Hawaii. Aloha.